One day, an entrepreneur presented the chalkboard presentation you're about to view to a group of seven people. One of them acted on the information and retired wealthy in under one year. He went on to write international bestsellers that have been translated into dozens of languages. The other six people spent the rest of their lives as worker bees and are now either dead or dead broke. Soon, it'll be your opportunity to make a decision based on the same facts. Watch closely, because the man at the chalkboard is the guy who took action, and he speaks from experience. This information is so threatening that in 2009, after he was invited to deliver it at a major university, the hierarchy of that same institution censored him. In fact, this class was banned. You know, in April of 86, when I saw the chalkboard presentation you're about to see, when a man who had been a Ph.D. from a university stood up to the chalkboard and showed me the two plans operative in North America, and indeed in all of capitalism, I was so flabbergasted that there were two plans. I said, where did that come from? How come I didn't learn that in first? I should have been learning about that plan in the first grade or the second grade or certainly in high school. No. You don't know about this plan because it's not being taught. And the only reason I decided to do this chalkboard demonstration and show you this class in fundamental economics is because I was called by a major North American university four months ago and invited to lecture at the economics class with all kinds of graduate and undergraduate students. They called me and they said, would you come and teach our class? Would you send us a curriculum so we'll get a general idea for advertising purposes what you're going to be teaching? And I gave them the information I'm about to give you, and they banned me from the university. They said that the plan I was teaching was too volatile. So I'm going to give it to you for free. I'm going to fling it out there in space for anybody who wants to use it. You won't see my name. You won't see a capture page. You'll see absolutely no economic motivation. I won't ask you to buy anything. This is all about me teaching you what I learned in April of 86 and in 11 months allowed me to retire from basic poverty and move to Aspen, Colorado to be a snow ski bum for two or three years on all my wealth. There are two plans in global economics and they're operating right now. And by the way, you know, most people, 95% of all people, according to the National Education Association, do not read one book a year. I try to read five, ten books a month minimum because that's my hobby and I've got the freedom to do that. Friends, if you find anything I say a bit disconcerting, if you want to learn more about the 40-year plan, may I humbly beg you to buy one book. It's by a guy named David Corton and the book is called The Great Turning. Who is David Corton? Well, let me just read you from the back point, the cover. David Corton, Dr. Corton, worked for more than 35 years in preeminent business, academic, and international development institutions. He earned his MBA and PhD at Stanford. He was a captain in the U.S. Air Force in Vietnam with duty of special air warfare school teaching, and he was at the office of the Secretary of Defense office. Then he served as a Harvard professor for many years where he taught both undergraduate and graduate, e graduate economics. He's a brilliant guy. He's one of the bright. If you never read another book in your life, and if you find some of my comments a little bit hard to take, would you please do me a favor? Get this one book. I'm begging you. 95% of the people don't read one book a year. Please read this one book, because what I'm going to say is going to shock you tremendously. There are two, two plans, as I said. The first plan is called the 40-year plan. The 40-year plan is a giant pyramid scheme in which the top 1% control 95% of all assets. That's how a pyramid works. And that is a statistical fact about North America. The drones do all the work, and the elite, even if their companies fail, get multi-million dollar annual bonuses that flow directly from the bottom 95%. For 50 years, those in power have hidden the fact that the 40-year plan is a pyramid and denied that the four-year plan is the last bastion of free enterprise. Those engaged in the 40-year plan are little more than digital sharecroppers and virtual worker bees who've grown so weary of business as usual that many have literally given up. Don't. There's an option. 
In the 40-year plan, essentially, you become and I become what I would call a drone, a worker bee. For 40 years, well, let me diagram it for you. Statistically, this is what happens. At age 25, most of us have a sense of direction. And at age 65, there's a very interesting statistic that occurs after 40 years. For 40 years, the average person goes back and forth to work, back and forth, like a silly, sick, caged lion. And after 40 years on this plan, and it doesn't matter, drones are drones. Your uniform may be a little blue shirt with a name tag. It may be a white coat and a stethoscope. There are different uniforms for different drones. But these people go back and forth for 40 years of the 40-year plan. Here's the compelling statistic. Out of every 100 Americans who starts at age 25 with a sense of direction, by age 65, 31 are dead, 68 are broke, and one person is independently wealthy. Ladies and gentlemen, the 40-year plan is what we teach and what our kids have been taught for years and years and years. It is hokum compared to the four-year plan. Now, please understand, here's the lure of the 40-year plan. It's called compound interest. And the way that works is, if you can get your hands on $100,000 and go through five cycles of life that each last eight years, <laughs> let me just tell you what I mean by that. Compound interest means... Your money doubles every eight years. So if you could get your hands on, let us say, $100,000 at age 25, let's say you work hard from 22 to age 25, get your hands on 100000 Here's the beauty of it. In the first eight years, it goes to 200000 Great, huh? That's compound interest. That's the way drones make money. That's the way worker bees get their money in the 40-year plan. Eight more years, you are at 400000 Eight more years, you're at eight. My goodness, after five cycles, you're not only at 1.6 million, you're at 3.2 million dollars. Or $12,000 a month for retirement. Let me ask you a question. Have you got 100 grand in checking? Do you think you'll ever have 100 grand in checking or in savings that you can put at interest for five, eight year cycles so you can retire on 3.2? Oh, by the way, if you started today, in 40 years, that $3.2 million, based on the cost of living increases and regular inflation at current rates, would be worth about $700,000. So in other words, you'd be living below the poverty level if you stayed on the 40-year plan. That's the 40-year plan. Now, what happened was this guy steps up to the board, and he erases the 40-year plan, just like I'm doing. The four-year plan was created as a clear alternative to traditional capitalism that offers rapid and dramatic monthly income tied to legitimate products or services rather than investments that fund compound interest. It's possible to fail or succeed in either plan, but there are two huge differences. Fail at the four-year plan and you're out a couple of hundred dollars and a few months effort. Fail at the 40-year plan like 99% do, and you're headed for an elderly dormitory where you'll run out the clock playing bingo for toaster ovens with oatmeal dribbling down your chin. Succeed in the four-year plan and you're wealthy in 40 months. Succeed in the 40-year plan and you're able to pay cash for the hearing aids and electric cart you'll be using to get around Walmart. And hear the nice lady or man on the loudspeaker announcing the special sale on Jell-O. The four-year plan is so fascinating because it allows people, basically, to get involved in a program that will allow them to shop for better products uh, at home that are later shipped to them on a regular basis and become wealthy in four years because instead of tying your assets to any kind of uh, security or real estate or investment or financial sector expert, there is no principle to manage. There is no problem. Basically, it's called principleless interest, which goes kind of like this. Let's say in the four-year plan, and that's what we call it, that this really shocked me when I saw it. In the four-year plan, let's say it costs $250 to become a representative with a company that markets products that everybody already uses, you know, maybe toothpaste, shampoo, soap, whatever. I'm a great believer in redirected spending rather than behavioral modification. If you go to Harvard Business School, they teach a billion-dollar billion blueprint where they've analyzed companies, and what they've learned is the first criteria of seven is market size. Now, I don't know about you, 
if I'm going to have my retirement tied to products or services, I'm going to make sure I've got the biggest market sector of all. So do your due diligence. There are hundreds of great companies. I'm not going to get into any projections of earnings. They all have to you know, get your calculator out and watch these numbers. Let's say it costs $250 to become a member of the four-year plan. You pick a company that's got products or services about which you're somewhat excited, and, and everybody needs them, and we'll reorder them and reuse them. No hyperspin, legitimate products. Not overpriced to compensate people, legitimate products. Now, let's say you get 12 people in the first year, we'll just call this year one, and they're all using, now they all spend $250 and get $250 worth of product to start, or services or whatever, they're all spending $100 a month on the products. But they're not really, because every person they bring in for $250, they earn, let's say, 40%. Let's say they get $100 on the products in that starter kit. So you've got 12 people, and if you get one person a month for a year, you've got 12 people who are each bringing in one person. They're each shopping for free for $100. That's creating $1,200 volume. Are you with me? In the second year, that 12 becomes 144. Now, let me stop right here, because the Federal Trade Commission and the regulators of the government hate it when you try to pretend that there will be a mathematical certainty of growth. There won't be. You might have to get 150 people to find 12 who will stay with you. So let's just be honest for once. The four-year plan is as it implies. There's a lot of money in it, but it's going to be hard, hard work. But you've got 12 people who are capable of each getting one person a month. Now you've got 144 people at $100. Do your own calculation. In the third year, if everybody just got one, and they won't, again, I'm just giving you an idea here, you would have 1,600 people, right, at $100. You can do the math yourself. Get out your own calculator. There are hundreds of companies. They pay all different amounts, all different overrides commissions. The point is, in the four-year plan, your capital is tied to a proprietary funding vehicle, and it's principalist interest, rather than trusting somebody in the financial sector to invest your money in WorldCom or Enron, just in time for the collapse. And in the fourth year, let's, this is why we call it the four-year plan, you would have roughly... 20,000 people at $100 a month. Now, I'm not going to do any income projections. Get out your own calculator. Some companies are going to pay you on this 22,000, whatever number of people. They're going to pay you a small percentage, maybe 2 to 5%. Some are going to pay you 8%. But ladies and gentlemen, get your calculator and run the numbers here. The fourth year, if you've got 20,000 product consumers who are ordering $100 a month for their families to use, you're sitting on 20,000 times 100. That's 2 million in the backwoods of Missouri, and I guess it is in your home too. Do the math. What would you get on $2 million a month? Proprietary funding principle of centers that comes to you by FedEx. Listen. The 40-year plan is for drones, and I don't care what uniform you wear. If you're working 60, 70-hour weeks, fighting traffic, carrying around a cell phone, if you're tethered all day to a wireless feed drip of irrelevant minutia like a text machine, if you're twitting, if you're working 70, hey, switch to the four-year plan. Now, you're getting this information for free. The reason you're getting it for free is because I cannot believe in this day and age I could be censored and banned from teaching this to a, a graduate economics class in a major university. That's how scared the people in power are of you finding out what I found out in April of 86. One fact cannot be debated. The man delivering this chalkboard presentation decided to join the new game. In 11 months, he was earning enough to semi-retire and move to an Aspen ski home. Since then, he's coached thousands of people worldwide and written several bestsellers. The person who directed you to this lecture is in our plan, or you wouldn't be watching this. Switch plans and change your life or ignore this message like the six other people who saw it at the same time it was presented to Mark and stay the same. 
Most of those who ignored this chalkboard presentation are now calling Mark for help. Unfortunately, they've wasted years. So, we urge you to change plans today. I don't know what you're going to do with this information, but when I saw this chalkboard demonstration, I didn't sleep for a week reasonably. I, I was crazy. I was, I was trembling. I said, how come everybody doesn't know about this? And the mentor that showed me the chalkboard presentation said, well, because nobody dares to teach this in academic circles. It should be started in the first grade. As in the first grade, people should be exposed to the four-year plan. It should evolve throughout all their education. Instead, we've reached a point where I'm no longer allowed to teach it at the college level because it's too volatile, because they're turning out drones. Listen to me carefully. The 40-year plan is not doable anymore. The four-year plan is great. I got on it. It took me 11 months to move to Aspen, as I said, and the rest of my life has just been an absolute fairy tale. No degree, no special skills, no wealthy parents, no funding, no money, no real estate, no cash. All I did was I got involved in this, and I worked hard, and in 11 months, it was like whoop de doo zippity doo da Every month, the checks came in. Principal is interest based on proprietary funding vehicles. So I appreciate you listening, and uh, I hope the 40-year plan excites you, but I hope the 40-year plan changes your life. So I guess I've said it all. Class dismissed.